Hi guys, welcome to the show, uh, the Nat Chan. Today I'm going to talk about a few things. I've got some new figures. Yay! <laughs> uh, if you guys have watched previous episodes, you know that I just did Otakon Vegas recently. Um, that's where I got these lovely girls. Uh, they're the same. <laughs> Two sets of girls. Um, these are from Fate Collide, Prisma, Ilya, Fate Collide, Pri you know what, there's always a word in that title I forget, but anyway, it's a, it's the Magical Scroll spinoff in the Type Moon universe. I love these girls. This one's mine, and this one's mine. This one is my roommate's, and this one is my roommate's. We love it together, so our figures go together, because obviously they hold hands. How cute is that? Adorable. That's what that is. <laughs> anyway, yes, for anyone who doesn't know, hasn't heard, I love me some figures. Sorry, about my table. Uh, when I get all my figures up and pretty and on display, I'll do a video about my figures, but they're still not all out. Um, so during the Christmas season, I got behind on some of my simulcasting anime just because holidays and I was working on cosplay for Otakon and stuff happens. I know there are things shockingly more important than anime. But not really. Anyway, uh, so I just finished Denki Guy. I did a review episode a while ago about it. Uh, I just finished it. I really, really liked it. It was really funny. Uh, it's just a random slice of life comedy. Um, it's more of a mature com comedy because some of the stuff they talk about. But eh, if you like, if if you're looking for a good laugh, and it's about the geek culture in Japan, it's it's a good one. I like it. I don't think they're doing a season two though, which is really sad. <sighs> Not that one like that needs a season two, but it was just I really liked it, and I wouldn't mind some more. Um, this loser just finished Fate Stay Night season one, and <gasps> yeah, <laughs> that's what I have to say about the end of season one. But at least I don't have to wait all the way till September for season two. I'll have to wait till April, which also coming out in April. So excited. Um, I don't know if any of you read Seraph of the End. Well, I do. <laughs> and the anime adaptation for that starts in April as well. So I'm really excited for April. Should be a great month for anime. Woohoo! <laughs> um, I'm currently watching... That Magical Boy anime that everyone's watching that I can't ever remember the name of because it's really long and ridiculous. But I like it. <laughs> it's ridiculous and fantastic. Um, I'm also watching Beyond the Boundary, which isn't new. Not, not a simulcast, but I'm watching it and I'm really, really enjoying it. I already want to cosplay from it. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. What else did I have update-wise? I don't know. That's what I'm currently watching. Um, and I just told you what I finished. Um, I did just recently, not anime related, what? <laughs> I did just recently finally start watching Game of Thrones. Um, it's not that I didn't think I would like it, it's because I knew I would like it, so I was trying to avoid it, actually. <laughs> but yeah, I started watching that. I'm really enjoying it. There's some more money spent. <laughs> oh well. So, let's see. I talked about Seraph of the End, which you should watch the trailer for because it looks beautiful and I'm really excited. Uh, if you like action, drama, and vampires, check out Seraph of the End. <laughs> uh, I feel like there was something else I was going to talk about. Oh, um, I mentioned briefly last time the small 
convention in, in Moab that I'm going to be presenting at. They're going to let me do an art table. I'm really excited about that. Uh, I'll link my DeviantArt page. I do mostly fan art, but I do have some original stuff that I'm working on. I'm hopefully going to, web, going to get a web comic out this year, so keep an eye out for that. Uh, here's just a line art of something I'm working on. I'm doing a whole Lucky Star set for my table, so... I have Konata and Miyuki finished. I've just got to do the twins. I at least want to do those four. I do want to do more girls from that show because I love that show. Ah, oh, love Lucky Star. But I'm at least doing the four. Um, let's see. Next cosplay I'm doing, as I've said, is Zex Marquis. Um, then I'm doing, you know, I've got Fanatico Fest coming up which we're really excited about because we're at the con center, yay! Um, ooh, I got to do some voice acting in a commercial for it. Uh, that'll be exciting. I'll link it to hear when it's done. Um, after Fanatico, I have that library con I'm doing, and then I'm doing Fanime. That's the next big con I'm doing, yes! doing fanime. I'll be taking my Gundam Wing cosplay. Uh, I'm supposed to be finishing Weiss from Ruby. Oh, that's this. That's the other thing. Um, the creator of Ruby, well, one of the, the, the key animator for it, uh, passed away yesterday and it's really sad. He's only three years older than I am and really talented dude. So, rest in peace my man and my heart goes out to his family and friends and loved ones and fans so uh, yeah I'll be doing Weiss from Ruby in a group with my friends uh, I'm not sure what else I'm going to be doing for fanime cosplay wise but I'll let you know as we go along <laughs> uh, I don't think I have anything else left to talk about tonight sorry this was kind of random just an update and just talking about what I've been doing and I've been watching. Uh, have I played anything recently? I'm, I'm shocked playing Dynasty Warriors Gundam still. Um, still playing War in the North. I'm about halfway through that. Yeah, that's it, I think. <laughs> Sorry for a completely random, just weird update episode. But, uh,. You know, what have you guys been watching? What have you just finished? Uh, is there anything in particular you're looking forward to in the upcoming seasons? As far as anime is concerned, uh, are you reading any cool new manga? Excuse me. Uh, reading any cool new manga? I'd love to hear about it. Uh, video games coming up that I'm looking forward to. <gasps> Final Fantasy Type Zero HD for the PlayStation 4 even though I don't have one yet. I'm hoping to have one by then, but you know what? It's just not looking like it yet. <laughs> which is funny because I have Shadows of Mordor which I also haven't been able to play yet. Oh well! <laughs> I'm working on that. Alright, cool. Well, uh, thanks so much for tuning in, guys. Uh, I hope you have a great morning, day, night, whatever time of day you're watching this. Uh, please stick around with me for more nerdy adventures in my life, and be awesome. <laughs>